the Death Star is back. <laughs> So Star Wars Rebels has been building all season and subtly hinting at the creation of the ultimate power in the universe, the Death Star. How so, you may ask? Well, let's dive into the evidence. We know from Episode 3, Revenge of the Sith, that the Empire had already begun construction on the Death Star at the beginning of the Fall of the Republic, and at our current time period in Rebels, the battle station is still being constructed. It is well known that the Empire sources many parts for this battle station from all over the galaxy but one of the most crucial parts comes from the planet of Lothal. Throughout several episodes of Rebels, there's been a lot of references to mining. For example, in the episode 80 Array, Lando Carizian tells us he bought a puffer pig in order to be able to hunt out precious minerals in the ground. So what type of precious minerals are there on Lothal? Well, kyber crystals, the same crystal that they use to power lightsabers. We know that kyber crystals are on Lothal because Ezra received one while in the hidden underground Jedi cave. So why would the Empire want kyber crystals? To build a giant Death Star! This is even further substantiated by the episode Breaking Ranks, during which Kanan and Hera attack an Imperial ship carrying kyber crystals. The Empire is obviously gathering materials for their mechanical monstrosity. But don't just take my word for it. Listen to this soundbite from Pablo Hidalgo. Alright, well, so kyber crystals are what focuses the energy in a lightsaber to create a blade. So it's got this very potent ability to focus energy in a very powerful way. So I imagine if you had eight giant kyber crystals and perhaps arrange them in a ring and put them on a gigantic space station, uh, that could probably have some very powerful effects. So it's clear that the Empire is experimenting with something and uh, you can probably guess what that is. So what does this mean for our little band of rebels? Well, currently, the building of a Death Star is a subplot. When we see more direct episodes about mining or kyber crystals, then the Death Star will be the main focus. But think for a moment how awesome it would be if our rebels, Fulcrum, and the Bothan spies are the ones that steal the plans for the Death Star. What if this one theory ties all other parts of the story together? But that is for another video. Comment down below and let me know what you think about the role of the Death Star in Rebels. Thanks for watching this video and make sure to subscribe. And remember, the ability to destroy an entire planet is insignificant next to the power of the Force. So may the Force be with you always.